Hi everybody, it's Rebecca here. I joined in with UK and Ireland craft swaps and it was for the easel card swap and my partner is Victoria Gibbons. So for this we had to make an easel card and it had to include a button, a bow, um, handmade or not and one other handmade item. For example, a stick pin, art tile, or a flower. So, this is my make. I will move my name back. Thank you again, Gina. This is my easel card here that I have made for her. Um, what I have done is I've used the Prima Romance novel, and it's an A4 a card folded in half, so that'll make it the A5. And um, it folds up into the easel card like this. Um, on the front I've used the Prima Romance novel, I've got a couple of bits of washi tape coming into the side there. I stamped this stamped image, which is, let me find it from, it's a stamping disc cling stamp, this one. And it is a lovely one and it's called the Rose Corset. So what I did for that was I stamped it onto the card, so I've got the stand there, and then I stamped it onto white cardstock and I painted it with some pearlescent paints that I got from my anonymous rat giver. I've been having great fun with all the lovely goodies I got sent. Um, on here I've just added, popped up then on pop dots, um, and I've added a little um, rose at the neck, a bud, and some on the waistband there. And I've got the curly cues and then some stickles on it too. For the arrangement that I have on this side of the card here, I have a doily with a cotton centre which was also gifted to me, thank you very much. Um, I filled in with a cluster of flowers from my stash, um, some acrylic ones, some roses. These were actually gifted to me, these two big pale pink ones. Um, charm which I think was uh, I got in a rack as well. And um, There's a little love charm down here that I tied a bow in the top. So my bow, there's one bow there. <laughs> um, and it's got the word love written across it. This is some lace that I gathered together um, and made into a little butterfly with a pearl, flat back pearl there for the butterfly. I don't know if you can see that in there. I just made it look like I've got the antennas and stuff and made it into a little delicate butterfly. I have got a little charm here that I got in the last swap that I was in, I think it was. And this is lovely, it's a, like a silver clock face and curly cues some more well, it's just a big star a big arrangement of flowers in here and some pearl spray this is my handmade item that was one of the requirements and what it is is that little glass um well, what do you call them you get them in the garden something like the glass beads and i took a stamped prima stamp of the crown and i put that in behind it so it looks like a crown sitting on the top and then i've got one of these um lovely leaves in the background here um, I think that's all in the front. I cut along the Prima start here um, and with the doily Martha Stewart punch added a row of the pink and black bling that I think I got from Lou. I'm sorry if it wasn't you Lou but I think it was you that gave me this one so thank you very much. And then in the inside what I've decided, um, it's just a normal easel card, I decided to leave it blank so they can write their own sentiment or message in there. I have um, some flat black, black pearl and some bling in the corners there that I've just added on the inside. This is just layered up three um, lakes cut um, dies and I used this as pink and cream polka dot kind of distressed paper so in my mind's eye stack and then I punched some butterflies out that stack as well and put them in and then my button is in the inside down here and I tied a bow around it as well so I actually have more than one bow in this card but it's just how it worked out. So that is my easel card for my swap, so I will get this in the post to Victoria and I'll probably upload this after she gets it actually I think. So that is my card, I, um, I hope you all like it and it's a great being back in the swaps again. I've just been busy doing other things so I haven't been around. Um, but this was good fun, enjoyed making it and I uh, look forward to joining in with some more. So thank you for watching and I'll be back again soon. Bye!